Good morning. 12 days of Christmas. The nine. Oh Lord, I off track already. Fire skies blazing bright. With big freedom on the mind. And this Christmas will be. Okay, so this is gonna be brunch. Yeah. Um giving me some protein. I need that this morning. And I got some meat I'm gonna make some crock pot beef stew because I don't go to work until 3 p.m. to like midnight so come Sunday Sunday dinner will be ready if that makes sense y'all saw I went in at 5 well at 3 30 yesterday morning and um that schedule has been running like that for some time and eating grilled nuggets and a fruit tray from Chick-fil-A is cool, but that's ten dollars a day, BB. Y'all know I cheap. I, I didn't do that. realize this one right here was only twenty grams of protein. The regular ones are thirty. So I'm gonna brew me a little four ounce shot of coffee to go in a thirty gram protein shake, kind of like a latte type thing for later. And let's get cooking. Y'all cooking with me today. I'm one of these people, I don't care what the collective say, baby rinse your meat. Okay. Rinse, wash your meat, however, and clean your sink. See, black people, we've been used to doing our dishes with a cap of bleach water and cleaning our sink before and after we do the dishes anyway. So this ain't nothing new to us. But baby, rinse your meat. I don't know what them people talk about. This is going to be my first seasoning that I use, y'all. And I got it down in the sink. I packed my meat dry. Y'all can't see it. But y'all can hear me sprinkling away. This Weber seasoning on beef is everything. Then I'm going to hit it with a little pinch of this roasted garlic and herb by Weber. Season your food, honey. On food TikTok, that's what I call it. Because I showcase a lot of like what I cook and bake over there. Y'all really, guess what? People don't season their food. Sorry to say. When it comes down to seasoning too, it could just be a cultural thing. Like how black people just grew up seasoning their food. And in a lot of cases, in black households, um, there is such thing as over-season. We over-season to where it's too salty. And that's where the high blood pressure and things like that kick, out, kick in. Because um, remember back in the day, all your mom probably had was Lowry seasoning salt or something that was too salty, like... Maybe like the 2000s, you know, they might have got into like garlic powder, onion powder. But back in the day, in most households, it was that more in salt, the girl in the, in the blue box, some kind of seasoning salt, and God forbid accent. I don't even buy accent to this day. Like, I, it just never did anything for me. But then when you get older, you started seeing stuff like this. Like, um, I guess you can see this one right here is a... Uh, it's like uh, you find it on the ethnic Spanish out. So yeah, body of complete is like the ethnic Spanish seasonal. And it's not as salty and it gives good flavor. I found this size right here at the Dollar Tree. So I don't even go back with seasoning salt. This is going to do it right here. Now I will say this about TikTok. The creators and stuff like, you know, a lot of them, a lot of us, we respond to each other. Um, but see what I mean when I say back in the day? See, I'm searing off my beef with grapeseed oil. Back in the day, your mama probably would have had a old, um, like some bacon fat, which that would make it good, but I don't have that. Or some vegetable oil, I have that, but I choose to use this. So, it's all about options. And your food, seasoning food don't mean salty. And that's what some people don't understand and don't know. And as I got older, I got into different herbs like fresh thyme basil and all that i'm watching the food network help now my mama soul food is awesome but she didn't use all those things so you know just doing something a little different. i got four tablespoons of butter down here 
two spoons, two regular cereal spoons like that of flour. Butter still melting. We cooking off the flour taste. And I'm going to add beef broth and a beef bouillon paste to make my gravy. Put it in the slow cooker and that's it. So look y'all, my broth is the reduced sodium one. I love that because I go back and season with these. So I'm going to do a smidge of this, a little bit of beef base. And if you do that, you don't have to go back and re-season your gravy. A little bit of beef. So I have everything nice and congealed together. I'm going to transfer that over into the slow cooker. I'm going to add a few pieces of fresh peeled garlic. Put it over in the slow cooker, let us do its thing. The potato, the carrots, the mushrooms, I'll add probably in the morning so they don't get too mushy. And yeah, now I'm going to do my makeup and get my ass Sorry. ready. This crock pot is about seven years old. I paid for it for Christmas one year. My brother got it for me and I still have it. Along with the air fryer from this y'all. Um, but if y'all into slow cookers and y'all have not started using slow cooker liners, baby, what have y'all been waiting on? Game changer, lifesaver, and that way you're not scratching up your ceramic because you have to go in with a scouring pad when that food is really on my day off. I put that beef stew meat over into the crock pot last night before I went to work. Got off about midnight. It was nice and tender. Put some veggies in and let that do what it do. Look at my Shopify. It is popping. Y'all, my link is in my bio. Diva Lux Candles Decor and more 40% sale is still going on. Okay? All right. So y'all know that two plates come out who that's for. Put down some jasmine rice. And I don't want him out in the cold. So I figure something stick to your ribs nice and warm. I'll hold him over till my next two days. Up, walked it over there to him and it is what it is I got up about 8 30 like I kept popping out waking up so it's about 8 about 8 30 it's about 9 30 now I'm enjoying my coffee y'all I just added different creamers just to use them up out the refrigerator because other than that they'll sit and it looks pretty when I put it in the cup it's so oddly satisfying corny I know but we got a